Hey everyone, Joel Anster here, my good friend, Miss Judy. Guys, Yay. back by popular request. <laughs> uh, we're here to do another food challenge, your second food challenge. Yes. So, first off, you ready? Yes, 100%. So, awesome, guys. So today we are outside City's Sports Bar and Grill. City Sports Bar and Grill. Cities, there you go, there's a sign. Um, in Mississauga, Ontario, right by the Toronto Pearson Airport, the big YYZ airport. Um, so this is a giant challenge featuring a whole bunch of Canadian pub food classics, I guess you could say. So we have, I believe it's five or six burgers, and I think one's a chicken burger, so it's like their whole menu of burgers. Then we have a whole bunch of French fries, um, specifically poutine, and then sweet potato fries, and then a whole thing of, thing of nachos. I'm telling you, this is huge. Yes. I think they said this is about 14-ish pounds of food, if I'm not mistaken. So we're gonna kind of see, because that sounds massive. Um, but anyway, we're, I know it's 45 minutes. I think the price tag is about 120 or 100 bucks, something like that, if unsuccessful, free, if completed. Judy, ready to eat? Yes. More so, than ready. Yeah, I haven't eaten all day. I don't think you have either. So uh, guys, it should be fun. So tune in, have fun with these food. I'll get you some more details, and uh, let's get eating. Hey everyone, real quick, I want to thank sponsor today's video being HelloFresh. So HelloFresh is America's number one meal kit, delivering mouth-watering seasonal recipes and pre-measured ingredients delivered straight to your door. So HelloFresh makes cooking at home fun, easy, and affordable. HelloFresh delivers fresh quality produce from the front of your door in less than a week, allowing you to enjoy delicious flavors of the season right from home. You can also skip the grocery store so you can spend more time either soaking up the sun or doing your busy day-to-day -day activities. HelloFresh can also help you achieve your goals with fit and wholesome recipes that make it easy to eat well without sacrificing flavor. And ultimately, you can feel good about your food choices with HelloFresh. Additionally, the pre-portioned ingredients help to not only reduce prep, but also prevent food waste. What I love about HelloFresh is seriously how simple it is. And everything you need literally comes in the bag. But first you just pick a plan, literally get your delivery, and then from there you cook, eat, and enjoy. It's also flexible so you can skip weeks, you can easily cancel, you can personalize your plan based on your flavor and ingredient preferences. There's also tons of recipes and the website's super easy to use so check that out right now. And use my link or go to hellofresh.com and use the code POGJOLSEPT16 for 16 free meals across 7 boxes plus plus three surprise gifts. Once you click, my description will live update to count up the purchases. So save some time, try some different meals, enjoy some different foods, and like we said, use that code, click that link down below, and at that, let's get to the rest of the video. All right, everyone, so here with all the food, and they actually weighed everything out, so I really appreciate the honesty, so if you want to know the specifics, um, with the different burgers here, so each of them have a half pound of beef. Um, we have uh, what is two and a half pounds of sweet potato fries, two and a half pounds of normal fries, plus the cheese, plus the gravy. So let's say that is roughly about six pounds, uh, maybe a little more, we didn't weigh the gravy, we weighed everything else. Then this is about five pounds of nachos. So there alone we have 11 pounds, plus all the burgers. Of course, where to start? I just happen to be sitting in front of the burgers, she's happened to be sitting in front of the nachos. We're gonna eat them equally, eat wherever and whatever you want. Um, we we're probably gonna start, I mentioned that chicken burger yes, you want. Yes, that one, the chicken. All right, so in that case, if you want to grab that grab chicken it. burger, I'm gonna grab one of these burgers as well. Ooh, we have, really they're, they're, yeah, they're all made with, uh, all the beef burgers made with Wagyu. We have like the, the classic Wagyu burger here. Then we have the jalapenos and everything. So I'm definitely excited. Judy, you ready to get rocking? Yes. How about we get started? Let's say it'd be count of maybe five, four, three, two, one. Let's see. I do love a burger. Mm. Mm. Oh wow. Hey everyone, welcome to today's video where today we are here at Cities, yes, Cities in Mississauga, Ontario, here taking on their giant pub food challenge. So Canadian pub food. They have a charbro. Sorry guys. Big bite. They usually that char grill shop charbro thing. Mm. I love the taste. It's not dry, it's very flavorful. Very. Good? Yeah. I've been so preoccupied. Yeah, this is awesome. I love to taste that, that fire. Something about fire and beef. Mm. Very good. And you guys don't have to be quiet or anything. You guys can be as loud as you want. So. Mm. He's fast. Oh my god. 
not a race between us. Guys, that was awesome. I tell you what, I do love a burger. This one is the, uh, oh, this one's over the jalapenos. Got some nice looking jalapenos on there, maybe a little picante. I guess you could say. So for this challenge, we had, as we saw, these six burgers, a giant, giant, giant tray of nachos, which were fully dressed with cheese and lots of healthy veggies too. Jalapenos and tomatoes and all that good stuff. We then had a big thing of sweet potato fries and poutine. So this is the two person challenge. Um, you actually can do a one person version as well and it's about half the food, um, or I think actually is specifically half the food. Um, the price on this team one was, I think it was $130 if I'm not mistaken. And then the single one would be about 65. So literally it's about half, um, 45 minutes, get that meal for free. I have the helping now. That one might be jalapeno too. Um, so we were definitely in the quest, Judy and I, for that free meal. We're hoping to be the first ones to defeat this undefeated challenge. Good size burger, but man. And I gotta say, things were looking good. I gotta say, great flavor. Forgot to show the camera. There you go. <laughs> These like Wagyu infused patties. Like I said, just a great tasting beef. But I will say guys, I love, 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 love that charbroiled burger, that grill, man, that beef on, beef on fire, guys. Mm. So good. This is good, what? What? Um, yeah. This is number three. Mm. I love it. First bites were absolutely fantastic. Definitely a good solid burger. Love that beef, that kind of fire and beef action. Um, Judy spoke very highly of the chicken burger as well. Um, and as we said, like the food, even though you know the burgers were and fries were in front of me and the nachos were in front of her, um, it was just because the trays were so large. Uh, you know, this one, the cheese and the jalapenos, guys. I gotta say, everything was fair game, and uh, definitely we both got what we wanted to get. Good amount of cheese on that, that's for sure. Uh, we ensured that we were definitely going into this as a team not racing each other not seeing who could eat more but rather as a in a team effort to defeat this challenge in the short 45 minute time limit the different types of burgers you know some of them had like jalapenos on them some of them had you know how much different sauces and cheeses um, it was literally like every burger from their menu delicious miss judy would you like me to save this burger for you or keep going Keep going. Okay. Next burger, guys. Mmm. Ooh, sweet potato fries. I love sweet potato fries. Or yam fries. <laughs> I don't know what you guys call them down below, but let me know. Yam or sweet potato? Team mm. yam. She's team yam. I am team sweet potato. So I'll just save you all the details if you want to check it out. Definitely check out the menu to get the exact specifics. Um, what was really cool is they do have a uh, wagyu in the patties. Every time I bite into a new burger. More and more delicious. It's amazing. Thank you. So this is a really nice kind of fat content, and that juiciness definitely helped. Uh, kind of everything go down and just really good flavors. Of course, you know, I had some ketchup. I'm all about that ketchup. And oh my gosh, guys. All right, so when it comes to french fries, I eat a lot of french fries, but I love sweet potato fries. How much time? I think we're about five minutes in. a bit over five minutes. We're definitely gonna need that time now. These nachos are gonna take a long time to eat. That's a huge, huge, huge tray of nachos. Let me know down below if you're a sweet potato fry or a, I guess, just golden fry or just fry person. So give me a hashtag sweet or a hashtag fry down below. I'm impressed. A lot of people here, they're being still quiet. I am definitely hashtag team sweet. 
or if you want to call them yam fries, you know, whatever, sweet potato fries, yam fries, whatever you want to call them, delicious. Um, and then the poutine, I already described what it was, but yeah, poutine is a, a Canadian originating dish, specifically French Canadian. Um, you know, hey, it's pretty interesting. I mean, it's cheese and gravy on French fries. If you like that stuff, you like that stuff, no complaints. At that though, that's pretty much the majority of the information. Um, me and Judy both knew we were gonna have to kind of dig deep for this. It was an absurd amount of food and definitely a pretty like high level challenge. Uh, that being said, all right, burgers. I'm probably gonna get a rock and roll on some of these yes. fries slash nachos. I will let you get to the rest of the video. Um, if you want to do the challenge, definitely give them a call ahead uh, just to ensure everything is good to go. Um, but at that, ultimately, let's get to the rest of the video. It was, it was good to be back kind of in this Toronto, Mississauga area. It's been a long time actually since I did any eating in Ontario, so I was happy to do this quick stop and uh, definitely stay tuned. Maybe I'll have another Ontario eating event coming soon. So with that, let's get to the rest of the video. I like it. So again guys, poutine. Mm. Fried gravy and cheese curds. Sorry, I forgot again. No, don't worry. Nachos. <laughs> Nachos. 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 A lot of toppies. <laughs> I will try to eat a little bit over a plate, but mm. that may, that uh, mayo is good. But me and Judy discussed before we both opted. We said it doesn't really matter about eating side plates. Keep it messy. We agreed sharing is caring. Gotta say though. So, it's a lot of it's gonna take some time. I think we're about maybe nine minutes, 20 seconds in. Good thing we're hungry. A lot of food. <laughs> All right. You didn't eat anything. No, me no neither. Water. First thing I ate today. I gotta say too. Up top. The poutine kept is like keeping really well. Fries are cooked perfectly. And they're still remaining like nice and crisp, real good texture. That's a good thing. I'm gonna help you with some of these nachos. I'm super slow. Cause they know you're not slow. Nachos are just timely to eat. So we'll definitely try to uh, get going here. Again, we're gonna need this time. These are uh, not quick foods to eat. And this is Judy's second food challenge. If you ask me, she's telling. <laughs> Not as fast as the last one. Nothing like nachos and a diet soda. Delicious. Anything else, Jude? Any drinks or anything? No, you're doing good? Judy, carefully organizing the nacho plate. Because we want what? Leave no doubt, right? Leave no doubt. <laughs> I like it. Learn as you go. I just elevate you. Nachos and salsa, everybody. Nachos and salsa. Definitely a good spread of what we'll call like traditional pub fare. 
I would say burger's fantastic. Fries are really good. Ain't no complaints. Can I bother us for, uh, can I get another uh, thing of salsa or two, maybe two more? Thanks, my friend. Yam fries for Jim fries. I think 16 and a half minutes in. Still delicious. I actually really like the cheese sauce and put in those nachos. So about probably about half ish the nachos, maybe a little less than half. I anticipate about half the fries. So Slowly but surely. Ooh, and here we got some more salsa. Which I do do appreciate my salsas. You just put them wherever, my friend. Thank You're you. not interrupting. Thank you so much. Thank you. Ooh. Yeah, so we'll keep rocking. Ro we'll keep a rock rocking and a rolling. There you go. Rocking and Yeah, whatever I was saying. <laughs> if you guys haven't noticed too, I Probably talk a little too much. And I Judy just don't talk. Judy just eats, so yes. she does well. She does talk. I will talk later. Both talk later. Only when my stomach is full. Uh huh. Yeah, I'm chilled out. No funny business. No games. Nope. Focus. I had a great big pile back here. Oh, lots of chewing. Oh, this is from the yam fries. Well, I'm not even thinking about it. I got one too. Lots of garlic, really, really nice. Big thing in nachos, everybody. A lot of food in general, but. Big thing in nachos. In the words of High School Musical, we're all in this together. <laughs> <laughs> you know what team means? Together, each one, achieve more. Fresh Miss Sweet Potato Fries, everybody. In general, I like a more crisp fry. Sometimes it makes it a little more difficult, but man, are they ever good. Judy says I was a, I'm a <laughs> sauce vacuum. That's the first time I've ever heard that one. But I do love my sauces. Ketchup. I, yeah, ketchup, salsa. Sponsor him ketchup. Uh -huh. Good, that first bite of the burger was. Yeah, the, I, I gotta say, I'm, I'm reminiscing about the burger too. Those the burgers are great. Chicken was good. I didn't try the chicken, don't try I'm the beef. I'm still Probably about almost 27 minutes in. Do you care which one? Yes. <laughs> yes? What do you want? Yeah, right. You want the yeah? Okay, yeah. I'll help. That was a very definitive yes. <laughs> I will not refute that. I'm happy to have these. This is really good.
very refreshing. Actually, these are the last of the oh, hamburger sweet potato fries. Where are we, where are we hiding at? Oh, ooh, excuse me. Sorry, that was uh, that was unexpected. <laughs> it was mixed with the poutine. Um, for those wondering, poutine is spelled P-O-U-T-I-N-E, or poutsin if you're French. It's not P-O-O, -O, blah blah blah. <laughs> and like I said, everybody, it is a uh, a generally a Canadian dish, kind of originating from Quebec, so French Canadian. It is a staple in a lot of Montreal and Quebec. Poutine. All right. Here. There you go. Thank you so much. Ready? Cheers. Cheers. Boom. Let's do it. Mm. Take your time. Mm. I'm really taking my time. <laughs> Let's see. Uh, she's, she's milking it. She's milking it now. Let's see. And we're done? Maybe? Woo! Let's see. Ah, there we go. Woo! Awesome. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Alrighty. So I want to say that was roughly 31 minutes and maybe like 10 seconds. Woo! You guys will have an exact time on screen. But! Woo! Judy, what'd you think? It's really nice. I'm still thinking about the first bite. The chicken burger? Yes. I would have to freaking get one if it's that dang good. E I gotta say though, guys, I'm 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 pretty dang full. That was a that was Me a too. that was a, a pot belly moment right there. But yeah, I gotta say, first off, huge thanks to everybody here at Cities, guys. Really cool spot. Again, the staff have been fantastic. And uh, like I said, it's it's actually a really like it's kind of tucked away a little bit, but it's a really good, um, it's a really cool spot. I definitely recommend it. And they have so many different TVs here. I know they're doing sports like the U yeah, sports games or UFC events. Mm. I love the UFC. I don't think I'll be around to make it to the fight tomorrow. There's a fight tomorrow, but I'll definitely uh, have to come back here. And uh, like I said, is it Mississauga? Kind of by the airport, the, the famous Toronto Pearson airport. I did all my talking. Judy, what'd you think? It's fantastic, really. Uh, I wasn't a big nachos person, but I started and just couldn't stop. <laughs> I was just like going and going and going, right? So you enjoyed it? Yes. I think 100%. it's... And the chicken burger, I can't emphasize that more. Okay, well, hey, like I said, <laughs> maybe I'll have to try a chicken burger. Go. I gotta say the, uh, yeah, I think, I don't know, like the nachos, I don't know just like the, the, the actual nacho we're using, or maybe it's that cheese sauce they put yes. on it, but something gave it like a really nice flavor. I really like it with the salsa. Again, I'm, I am the a big- The sauce is really good too. Yeah, the uh, sweet potato sauce, the garlic, mm -hmm. chipotle, chipotle mayo kind of thing, house made. Um, but at that front, we do give them for free, which is pretty cool. And um, that's about that. I don't really have any other words. Just thanks to all the staff here. A lot of food, that is dang for sure. I definitely recommend stopping on by. Don't, I would not recommend eating a plate this size, but I really liked that the burgers were great. And uh, obviously chicken burgers were great yes. as well. Yes. So. Team chicken burger and team yam fries. Team chicken burger, <laughs> team yam fries. Actually, that's a good pair. I'd take that. Um, that's about it. Any final words? That's it. That's my second challenge. That's it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Huge thanks yes. to Judy. Second challenge, guys. Um, she joined me for her first challenge as well. Um, it was a pizza challenge. Um, but yeah, so there we go guys. Till next time. Stay happy, healthy, hungry, happy eating. Maybe, maybe, maybe we'll see what else we got coming our way. Maybe we'll have another bite. I don't know. Maybe, maybe. It was it was all really, it was really, really good. So anyway, till next time everybody, like I said, maybe we'll see you back in a minute. And if not, appreciate you. Have a lovely day. Everybody, so uh, just real quick, I did decide to get one of these chicken burgers that Miss Judy spoke up so 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 delightfully. So they said it is a um, marinated chicken. I think there's a dry rub on it. Then they put that chipotle uh, aioli on it, and then all of the veggies. So let's give this a. It does smell good, and it looks really good. Like she said, nice and juicy. So let's give this a try.
Give it a bite. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Very moist. Very, very moist. Surprisingly moist. Yeah. And then that grill. I love that grill flavor. Here's go. Now you know what I'm saying. Judy didn't want any other foods <laughs> we offered. You said you're what, 98% full? Yes. Good place to stop then, but. Comfortably. Comfortably full. Yeah, that's so. That sauce is really nice. I mean, even like, I, probably, I love sauce, so I'll probably eat more of that on there, but yeah, good addition. Very moist. Perfect. Well, I think it was the after show. Well, <laughs> that's about that, guys. So, like I said, thank you again. Judy, we actually got hats. They gave us a hat here. It was a big uh, Blue Jays game. Hey. So, shout out to them for the hats. That was really, really nice. Not something they had to do. So, appreciate that. And that's about it. That's it. Have a good day, guys. Guess what? You rock. Yes, you rock. Thank you so much for watching the video. I totally appreciate it. I hope you left me a comment down below. I'd love to read them. I hope you also liked that video. Hey, by the way, click my face. You can subscribe. Yes, subscribe. That way you always get my uploads. You won't miss me when I'm in your town. And I also picked two videos for you. Yes, two videos I know you'll love right here. So watch one of those. Hit my face. And with that, thank you so much. You rock.